Brian, forgive me for asking two Andrew Reserve questions in a week, which violates all rules, I'm sure. But no, I, not I, at all. Know, yeah, I, I know, of course, once the guy starts practicing, he's designated as a guy to return in one of the two slots which you have to use. So we saw yesterday Van Ginkle and Davenport walking around the locker room, seemed fine, obviously, just in terms of their gait. Uh, are any of those guys <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Or, or led better? Yeah, are they know. physically able to practice yet? where you just don't want to make a decision yet on which two guys you're going to activate, or are none of them physically able to practice yet? I guess my first thought is uh, their gate in the locker room won't really, <laughs> won't really right, give you – that's, that's not the barometer we're looking for. But that's – yeah. That's not really, you know, something I'm, I'm pinpointing as far as whether or not they're going to get back to practice. Exactly. But uh, – uh, all, all those guys you mentioned, they're, they're, uh, they're working well. Um, we're actually going to uh, uh, bring Davenport. He's going to practice today. Um, and that will just start the clock. Um, and we'll just see how this, this, this works. Obviously, like you said, we only have two guys we can bring back. Um, so Dap Julian will be out there today. Um, we're excited to get him back out there. Um, he's been working you know, as hard as anyone. Uh, from a rehab standpoint, from a training standpoint, wants to get out there. Um, we know that there'll be some rust uh, from you know not being um, in practice for uh, a long period of time. So try to knock some of that off and uh, and get them going. Uh,